Here you can see we've got a great stand of carrots, but it's all tops. What we're interested in is obviously the bottom root portion of this plant. The most common way to plant these is by broadcasting the seeds out into the garden space, but then we end up with a situation like this. A common problem with carrots might be that one carrot has three or four different tap roots. This can be an issue caused by planting them too densely. It's always tough to know exactly how far apart those carrots should be depending on the growing site, the soil, the amount of moisture they're getting. What we need to do to avoid this situation is go through during early summer, first part of the growing season, and actually physically remove some of those carrot seedlings. If things really aren't taking off, then you might need to go through and actually thin a little bit more. Some people might mix other seeds within those carrot seeds. So in this instance, we can see where the homeowner has planted some radishes at some point. That helps kind of break up how many seeds are actually planted. Other people might actually buy seeds that are planted on tapes. Basically, the seeds are on a piece of tape, then you can plant those in a row. For more questions regarding vegetables in your backyard, contact your local Extension office. From the University of Wyoming Extension, I'm Brian Sebade, and you're watching From the Ground Up.